what's going on everybody it's your boy john or deny coming at you with another video as always and as we are getting closer and closer to saturday the upcoming release to the nike sneaker travis scott collaboration with jordan one you guys are wondering how to cop these shoes you guys are probably wondering how could we cop the you know the, the upcoming the most hyped up nike sneaker to to date basically not just the nike jordan one travis scott collaboration that's coming up but in the future in general shoes that are going to be coming out in the future you know if it's the mars yard shoes uh shoes like the jordan fours even though they already came out but shoes like those you know very hyped up very high-end sneakers that everybody is just trying to get their hands on and I'm here to explain to you guys how to do that. I'm going to give you guys three steps on how to do this a little tutorial. It's a little how to kind of like how to cop instantly without having to pay for bots, without having to pay for proxies. This is a cheap, simple way for those of you that just can't afford those cheap, cheap essentials. And bots can, can be really, really expensive nowadays. So I'm here to let you guys teach you guys. This is not my method. This is the method used by other YouTubers shown on YouTube this is just is basically kind of like a regurgitated thing I wanted to show it on my channel for those of you that never heard of it or never seen or never really knew about this tutorial till now so I wanted to give you guys this little quick thing on my channel so you guys have a thing have the tutorial readily available and up-to-date for you guys so I'm here to give you guys the best I guess the best quality video the best tutorial out there this is the, the shortest way possible so before we get into the main essential on how to cop, this is not this is not going to guarantee you a how to uh, copying. It's not going to guarantee you a, a W all the time. Now, personally, I've used this method many times. There are just three basic steps, three simple steps. Number one, you need internet. Very, very important. Number two, you need a computer. Computer, phone, Anything, tablet, device, any type of device, tablet, computer, laptop, anything, anything that involves you getting into the internet. Step three, you, this is the most important one out of the other two, would have to be friends or family. You need people to help you out with this thing. You need people to help you, mostly because when you get onto the Nike website, you need to make the Nike account. And when you're making the Nike launch account, you have to put in your phone number and then once you put the phone number you can never use it ever again it's a confirmation so that you can get onto the account that you're going to use to cop those sneakers so if you're going to make let's say six accounts you need to have six phone numbers readily available if your entire family is going to help you out perfect six family members six phone numbers you're set but if you want to make more than that you're going to have to have more people like grandpa you know your aunt your grandma your dad your mom your friends all your friends try to get as many of your friends i know it's a little bit hard to acquire i know you could also buy nike accounts but this is the cheapest way the, this is basically the free way to do it so i'm not encouraging you guys to buy nike accounts if you don't have to you just this is the best way just get your friends you know get a lot of people that you know to help you out with this if you guys really want to because I'm pretty sure not a lot of your friends, you know, are crazy about sneakers like you guys are watching this video right now. As I said, this is not going to guarantee you a W all the time. You will get L's. I've gotten, personally, I've used this method. I've gotten L's a lot. But these are, this is very simple, very easy. And um, it's worth the try. The stock amount, from what I've heard, is 108,000 pairs. Imagine that going against... 500,000 people, let's say. Let's say 500,000 people out of those 500,000, obviously, is only going to be 108,000 people that are going to cop. And you have to think about it this way that there's people that are going to try to cop twice, three times. So, out of those people, maybe it's like maybe one in 100,000. So, or no, three in 100,000. So, one of the out of those one people, they're going to cop three times, two times. You never know. So it's very, very unlikely that you, you'll probably cop these shoes, but maybe in the future you'll be able to cop these shoes. And you could tell your friends and people that you know about this tutorial that, hey, yeah, this does work. It does actually work if you use this multiple people 
account jig, I guess it's called. I'm quoting Keith Adams as he calls it. He calls it the multiple people jig. And um, it does actually work. I've seen a lot of people actually copy using this method. Now, personally, I would recommend using six accounts for this for this method. Um, I've tried eight. Usually when you use more than six, Nike tends to ban you from the website. But the best way to do it is just, I guess, VPNs. VPNs is kind of like a thing where it blocks your, it makes, it sets up multiple IPs all at once. And I think you have an unlimited amount and it's, uh, this is a Google Chrome extension. It's called Unlimited VPN. Um, I'm gonna have it in the link below for you guys so you guys could download it and um, add it to your Chrome extension account. And uh, when you make the multiple Chrome users, you're gonna have to download this extension to each user individually. Cause when I was making the users, I had it on my main account and it didn't load up to my other Chrome users. So you're gonna have to go back to VPN to that VPN extension and download them all individually. This could take a while, but to be honest, it it's about 30 minutes, maybe to an hour, but I promise you guys, it it's actually worth it in the end. So once when you have that downloaded again, I don't, okay, you can have it downloaded, this is the best way if you want to use more accounts than six. I recommend using six. That's the best amount you could use, in my opinion. But if you want to use more, you could use a VPN. You don't necessarily have to use it, but it's going to be down below so you guys could use use it. Maybe it'll help you out. I actually might use it for this release, see if it actually works. But other than that, I, I'm not really sure. This is a new method that Keith Adams, quoting him again, that he mentioned in his uh, video. So this is a new method. This is something new. The UVPN is new to me. So I've never used it, but I'm sure it's going to work. It's just another extension if you don't want to use proxies, but you don't necessarily have to use it if you're just going to use six accounts. Now moving on is making the multiple Chrome users. You guys pretty much know how to do it. All you got to do is just make another Chrome user, just keep on making them and then name them one, two, three, you know, whatever, et cetera, ABC, whatever you want to name it and just have multiple Chrome users. Once you have that set up, you go to the Nike website and this is where it kind of gets a little bit hectic. Once when you get on the Nike website, you have to make an account. Once you make an account, it's very simple, set up everything you can. When you get to the Nike launch account, it's gonna tell you to sign in and it's gonna ask you for a verification, your phone number verification. If you haven't made a Nike account ever and this is your first time doing it, it should be simple. But if you wanna make, let's say four accounts, like I said in the beginning of the video, you gotta get your mom, your dad, anybody for that phone number. You gotta get multiple phone numbers as you make more and more accounts. And then also don't forget about the Gmails, the uh, Hotmails, you know, your email accounts as well. So you gotta make multiple, either Gmail accounts, Hotmail accounts, multiple accounts for your emails and multiple phone numbers for your multiple Nike accounts. So finally, once you have all that set up, you ask all your friends, hey, can I borrow your phone number for this account? Once you have all that set up, you go to the launch calendar for Nike and you go and you set it up actually well on the release date you want to do this like a couple days prior before you don't want to do it on the day of release because you're not going to have a lot of time and you're going to be really really stressed out and you're only going to have about 10 minutes for this drop the jordan one collaboration drop is going to be uh it's going to be a raffle guys so it's going to be 10 minutes you once when you go you, you enter it so you, ha you have 10 minutes to get on all your nike google and your google accounts and your, all your nike accounts and just enter the raffle. And this is where the VPN kind of comes in and helps you out if you have eight. But if you have six, it shouldn't really bother you too much. Also, um, when it comes to your payment, do you want to try to, um, I, I don't really know if Nike gets or they track the, the payment accounts. I would recommend using PayPal. PayPal is like the best option you can use because you could you put multiple credit card accounts in that PayPal account. Um, like I have it set up and you could just have it like that or also another really really good way to use it is I personally use PayPal credit now This is not a sponsor video guys. I'm gonna mention that but I personally use PayPal credit It helps a lot and Nike can't really track that so you can use that multiple times in your all your accounts For Nike PayPal credit. It really helps for those of you that have a credit score you could sign up for PayPal credit and you'll have some money in there and you'll be able to sign up because Nike won't be able to track that. It's not an actual credit card. It's like PayPal type of card. It's like an online PayPal credit account 
so Nike won't really tell which is which compared to a credit card. So that's a better option. Sign up for a PayPal credit ac uh, account and you'll be able to have a higher chance, I guess, and your, your orders won't be canceled like other people have before in the, in the past. Now, for those of you that are wondering, uh, will my account get canceled? Yes, it could actually get canceled even if you copped. And another way to actually resolve this, to solve it, is through your addresses. You wanna set it up kind of in a certain way for your addresses, put spaces um, for road, try to spell out road, put it in caps, put a, a RD and a dot at the end. You, you guys basically get the gist of it. Um, also, like just turn, t change certain things. For example, like let's say Northeast, put capital Northeast or you know spell out Northeast. So, you know, set it up a certain way or add some, some like spaces or add like some random things like dots is very helpful in the beginning. Just space it out and it'll, it'll still, it'll still work. And Nike will still get what you're doing. You know, uh, I don't, I don't think Nike tracks that. They mostly track the phone numbers and the, uh, credit card accounts when it comes to buying the sneakers on their website. Pretty much it for this video. Um, let me know if you guys actually found this helpful this tutorial helpful now i'm going to use this method myself i'll let you guys know if it works i'm going to use the you uh the vpn extension to see if it works and i'll let you guys know i'll keep you guys updated i'll probably update it on my twitter maybe my instagram to let you guys know if it worked or not other than that let me know if you guys copped or not uh saturday we are going to be getting the travis scott times jordan one collaboration release at 10 a.m. So be sure, be ready for this release. Have your account, your multiple Chrome accounts, have your extension ready, um, have your Nike account ready. And other than that, let me know if you guys got a W. Subscribe to this video if you guys found this helpful. It really helps me out. Turn on your notifications down below. It's right next to it. it really, really, I really, really, really need it. It really helps out. And then also give support by liking this video and other than that, comment down below if you guys got a W, if you guys found this helpful. If I missed anything, I'll, I'll, I'll do a follow-up video. If I missed anything or any, if I was wrong with something or anything like that, comment down below. I'd like to know your opinions. Give me as much feedback as I can. Other than that, this was your boy, John or Deny, coming at you with a bunch of videos like these. And as well, as always, I'll see you guys later in the next video. Peace out, guys. Thank you.